Hi guys and gals. Sorry I'm late. Um I'm here with you every day. When it whenever you see a notice I'm here. Let me just turn this down a bit. The reason why I'm late is because I was trying to find some other way of broadcasting. So I need to turn my heating on. Bear with me. So what it is is that um today I'm just I think after twelve I'm gonna try and um read through you the whole Bible or even I don't know when I'm gonna just try to gonna try and find the time. What it is is that I'm gonna talk with you about that and um put it this way, yeah. You need, you need to say, you need to stay alive as much as possible. You need to like think in your mind and use your mind and spirit in in a way of staying alive, because that's how that's how um that's um how it is really. That's how that's where eternity starts. Um. I'm gonna I'm gonna go through the Bible. Go, yeah, like I said, yeah. I'm not gonna repeat myself. So, you can hear the music, but I'm not gonna try and turn it up, or else Facebook Facebook's gonna like ban me. So, um, let me try and get my Bible. I'm gonna literally start right now to be honest with you because I need to get this out. Okay. <clears throat> if you guys haven't know don't know me, because this is gonna be broadcast on YouTube as well. I'm uh I've been on YouTube for a long time. I think um, I think I am probably one of the oldest YouTubes ever. Uh, I've got I've got a YouTube account which I will use when I when I study to when I study to become a doctor. When I study to become a doctor, I'll use my my 26 year old YouTube account, Google account, um, and you'll see there that I'm one of the oldest um, YouTubes. I, I opened my my YouTube account in um I created a YouTube account in either the day or the week of when it was announced on BBC News. That was in 2005, August 2005, yeah, or after that, or 2006. Well, I think it was 2005. I think it was more like 2006 to be honest with you. So yeah, that's that. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, I suppose I'm waiting for people to come, but I mean, not really. <laughs> I'm just gonna crack get cracking at the right time. So I'm here all the way till 5 a.m. in the morning, reading through the whole Bible and explaining the the, the bits of the Bible that people don't understand because. When I was in my training in October 2019, God revealed to me um, today, sorry, God revealed to me um, God revealed to me from um, revealed revealed to me the, the past, present and future, mainly the future um, in one day, one month, 
one day, one week, one month, one year, for a thousand years, for eternity, just like the Bible says. <clears throat> you might be thinking, oh, here's this, here's this guy, this bozo guy, you know, Ricardo, you know, he with some sort of supernatural special knowledge. To be honest with you, I have, and I'm not messing around either, because I've seen some things that it's not just frightening, just really, really shocking and draw me to tears because I'm autistic as well. And I was so shocked that there was one time I did it. I showed the view in one of my videos, didn't I? Uh, because I'm, we I'm wearing this theme, you know, this Superman theme. You can't really see it anyways, that, that theme. And, um, what it is, is that, um, with that theme, I'm thinking it's just it's just gonna be for this for this year anyway for the time being, or whenever the right time is. So yeah, um, so what what it is is that I have got a revelation of what is coming up, and <clears throat> to prove to you that I'm genuine as well, I'm not I'm not just you know saying these things out of the ordinary is because also on top of that you know i'm giving this out for free i'm not actually charging anybody people will charge because they need to earn an income but because i don't because i'm a volunteer you know i'm actually giving this out for free so yeah this i'm actually answering the bits of the bible that people don't understand so that's what's going on really that's just a brief outline of what i'm talking about today and that's what i'm going to start from i'm going to start from the bible and then i'm going to explain the bible and i've been meaning to do that for a long time in especially the beginning of my um youtube career volunteer career uh, i've been trying to do that for a while and on top of that i haven't been able to do it because i just my mind wasn't there and, I, and I, my diet and you know I, I've, I've spent a lot of my life 36 years of my, i've spent i've spent 36 36 years of my life which i'm 36 now being ill and now i've actually i can, I can actually say i'm actually well and i'm not actually not i'm actually not on well which is a brilliant, brilliant privilege, I think, by the grace of God. So yeah, um, I want to put this in a stand where I can be seen properly, but I can't. It's a bit weird. Um, <clears throat> let's see what I can do. So I'm, I'm still warming up. I've got until five anyway, and and the reason why I wasn't um I didn't come on at six forty four is because I was trying to sort out some technical stuff. Just trying to get it put on my laptop but i wasn't able to so eventually when the windows because it sorts itself out out i'm going to actually um try and um do it again in a different way because with the laptop with the laptop you can see all the angles with the mobile it's not really good and i wasn't to come off mobile i was gonna, originally i decided to go on mobile but mobile isn't really it's not, it's not like it's not working for me i just don't want to do it I want to. I want to be more like homely, like widescreen kind kind of thing. So everyone can see what I'm doing. My my body function, my body arm reactions. No, no body reaction. My arm, my hand gestures, which I was trying to use a lot anyway. So um, you know what? I'm just gonna do this. You know, actually no, I can't do that. I really want it to be my whole shoulder, but um. No, that's not gonna work either. Okay. Oh, I need to go to the thing. Oh, mate, there's such a lot to do anyway. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm literally still warming up myself, trying to get myself organized. Yeah, that's that's more better. So, um. So there it is, that's it, that's good, that's good, that's good. Okie dokie. I'm gonna be frustrated because Sky's been an ass man. And a lot of companies, SSE and Sky have been a lot have been being up being real asses really because they just they owe me a lot of money. And I'm saying it publicly because it's really they're really winding me up. SSE and Sky, they, they owe me a lot of money. 
and I've paid a lot into them and they're taking too much money on my account apart from SSE SSE I've just joined but one lady was just being lazy so they want to support want to help me so uh, there you go I said it starting to pay me to sort out the money they owe me I'm getting a bit tired of it really a lot of a lot of people owe me money so um yeah um so uh the, 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 the I need to actually get water okay okay um I just want to get cool comfy okay keyboard there lock up there okay okay I need to get get this water here. Okay. Hi, boss. Whoever's watching. I'm here till five in the morning. So, saddle up, partner. Try and see if see this gonna work. Ay, 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 what have I done? They don't want me to really post a blank page, will they? I'm just posting it on Facebook now, but it's... Can't we really, let, let me just, let, let me just post a blank page. And I think they will. Oh, no, they won't, actually. Actually, they have. They actually have. <coughs> I will be starting, I just want to sort something out. I actually wonder if it's going to actually... No, I need to have the music in the background. The Old Testament. Right, let me see what I can actually. This is the last straw.
No, I mean... Walk of Fame, yeah. Just want to make sure it's actually, um, not working. So I took a while to work. It's actually not doing it. Let's see if okay. Kind of like what I was doing. I've actually got an idea, but next time I'll do it. Interesting. Very interesting. Interesting. Seeing working clearly. Okay, I'm gonna actually um get cracking up because it's just it's just ridiculous. Okay, um right, let's start from the beginning. I'm starting with Genesis. In okay, right, I'm starting with Genesis. Can I give you a tip as well whilst I'm here? You know when you you know when you're in the queue, you're in the queue for um customer services, a call center or something, yeah? Um 
Let me write this. Let me, let me write that in my topic that I'm talking about. Actually, I just thought I just thought of a tip. You know, when you when when you're in a queue and somebody you're in a queue over the phone, like customer services, um, in a call center, and then they and it, <coughs> you're in a queue. <coughs> I just found this out today. Actually, when you you're in a queue and they're um and you're waiting in there in, in a long queue and they're playing the music. When they're playing the music here, they're actually available to you, but they're actually letting you wait whilst they sort something out in the back office. Instead of sorting out later, they let you wait in. They let they let you wait there on in the queue for like half an hour, an hour, two hours in the queue until they sort themselves out and then they pick up the phone. But what the trick is, the trick is, yeah, if you pretend you're talking to somebody, then they'll think you're talking to somebody and they'll they'll jump in, they'll jump in, and then and then they'll jump in. And they say, oh, hello, this is um, Talk Talk, this is EE, this is um, Sky, all that kind of stuff. When you, when you, when you, when you, say, when you, start, when you, when you start talking, even, even, if you're, even if you're on your own, just, just pretend you're talking, pretend you're talking, pretend you're talking, and then um, when you're pretending to talk, just, um, and then, then they should pick up within about a few minutes, they should pick up the phone, because when the music's playing here in, in the background, they, 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 can, they can actually hear you. Okay, there's, there's an automatic music playing in the background, and and, and, you, and you think you're in a queuing system. But if you talk, like you're talking to somebody, do that, do that with anybody that you're waiting in the queue for. You, if you're talking, if you pretend you're talking. Even if, even if they say you're you're first in the queue, you're third in the queue, you're thirteenth in the queue, you're fifteenth in the queue, just keep talking, and eventually, yeah, you you you'll um you'll. When you when you keep talking on the phone in the court with the call center, you they'll um they'll they'll pick up the phone like minutes after. I'll, I'll say I'll say I'll say this again because someone just just um came in, just started to listen. So I'll say it again um to beat somebody when 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 like um when you're talking to like EE e. or like um British Gas or 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 or. Or Amazon.com or .co.uk. Anyone you're talking over the phone in the call center, and when you're talking to them, they they are um when you, when you so when you when you're in the queue and the music's playing, what it is is that they have they have they have a, the music's playing in the background, or they have a, they have a they, wait but it's like an it's like an external speaker, but ultimately yeah they listen to your voice to see if you're talking to anyone. If you if you're talking to anyone, they they they'll, they'll come in quickly and and talk to you. But if you're not talking to anybody, if you're not talking to anybody and and, and, and you're not saying anything, and you're silent, then they let you wait there in the queue, and then the music's playing, and you, they let you wait there in the queue, and you could be waiting in the queue for like one hour, two hours, and it, the 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 more the more quiet you are, the longer you wait. So what you gotta do is yeah, you gotta pretend you're talking to somebody, or, or even if you just just fake your fake it like your your fake just fake it like pretend you're listening to somebody. And then eventually they they pick up the phone like within one or two minutes or or straight away because it because they are actually there but they 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 they, they, they delaying it so that they they can actually they delaying it so that they can they can actually um so they can actually get on with their own business so that they, they don't have to do any much work when they when they so that, so they don't have to do much work when they actually when they actually get back home you know they, it, it just it just shortening their their workload but. Instead of instead of letting instead of letting you go quickly, they let you wait in the queue. It's just a st stress and waste of time. I just literally found out today, so I just thought I'd give you that tip. And I just have to repeat it because someone just came in listening. Um, so yeah, I'm going through. Like I said, um, I'm going through the Bible. Um, I need to write this down as a note. As um, <clears throat> so bear with me because I need to. I'm gonna. This is gonna be posted on YouTube as well. So bear with me whilst I write this down. So um So um so skip the queue skip the queue in in a call Center. I need to write these things down. So, not, so, so I'm, I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm doing my, my last of evangelism in but in bunches now. I'm not 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 one at a time videos not, not anymore because I've got so much information. I've got thousands of thousands of um thousands of um of of information. I need to like get it out of my system. I need to get it out. 
instead of keeping it in all the time. I'm flaming hot. Ah, oh, the heating's on and it's too hot, man. Wait, wait a minute, yeah. I am going to start here yeah, and I'm here till 5 a.m. So if you don't get it now, you get it soon. So bear with me. Temperatures change outside. Um, so here we go. Here we go. Yeah, I'm starting from Genesis. But let me tell you. Um, I'll read it and I'll, and I'll, and I'll explain and I'll, and I'll let you understand the whole Bible. Genesis to Revelation. I'm going to. Um, you see on my Facebook page where 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 I put where where we are at for this month. What what Bible passage we're on for this month? It mean it means. The month, the ma the month we're in February matches matches the matches where we are in Genesis in in in, in, the, in the Bible. So so because the Bible is actually a calendar, if you if you if you see it that way as well, it's a, it's actually a calendar. That's why they say you read the Bible in one in a year, and they're they're actually alph alphabetically ordered in the way of um what happens how you create the world, how you create a new world. Now this is this is it, yeah. I'm reading the um. This is the version I'm reading, the, the New King James Version, yeah? This one. The New King James Version. Sorry, the yeah, New King James Version Bible. Um, I was giving this to me by a friend, a great friend, man. He's like, I'm not really, I'm not in contact, I'm not in contact with him anymore. Sad, really, but that how, that's how it goes. I love to keep in touch with a lot of people, but I'm not, you know, people just don't want to keep in touch. And I'm reading the Old Testament. Look, here we are. I'm reading from the Old Testament. So I've been preaching a very, very regularly um, on YouTube. It's just that I need. I was just trying to find my, find where. I was just making sure that I'm in the right place because I, I was gonna do. I was gonna write a script, a film script, which I, I already am writing a film script anyway. But I was gonna. I'm gonna have to do it this way as well. Um, but remember, yeah, today, today, where there was an alert, an FB, there was, an, there was an FBA alert, so, and someone died today. Somebody actually passed away because, um, because of the, because of the. Cause I, cause I got a, I got a FPA alert, and um, and then someone actually passed away today because of the FPA alert I got. Because anytime there's an FPA alert, it's a warning for someone. Just someone is about to lose their life. That's what happens when I get these FPA alerts. Um, but that's because I'm a night walker as well. But that's an, that's another thing. But it's night walker comes from a night walker comes from a, um comes from the, the watchman in the Bible. That's where it derives from. So I am speaking from the Bible, but it, I am a an art worker is from the Bible, but I've just upgraded I've just I've just upgraded the name. I'm hoping I'm hoping I'm not speaking too fast. So here we are here. Yeah. Um okay, Genesis one. Genesis spelled is Genesis is spelled G E G E N E S I S. That's G E N E S I S. The first book of the Moses called Genesis. So here we are, okay, right. Let me read it here. So, um, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Two, the earth was without form and void, void, and darkness was on the, on the, on the face of the, and, and darkness was on the face of the deep, and the Spirit of God was hovering over the face of the waters. Then God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that saw the light what saw, saw the light that it was good. And God divided the, the light from the darkness. God called the light day and the darkness darkness he called night. So the evening and this morning were were where the first were the first day six v six then God said, Let there be form form permanent permanent in the midst of the waters, and let the let, let it divide the waters from the waters, thus God made the the firmament and the and and divided the waters which were under the firmament from the 
waters which were above the firmament and in and it was so eight i'm going to stop at ten and explain um to eight and god called the, the firmament heaven so the evening and so the evening and the morning were the second day then god said let waters under the heaven heavens be be gathered together in 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 into one place and let the dry land appear and it was so um v10 i'll stop here so it's um and god's called the dry land earth and the gathering together of the waters he called seas and god saw that it was good uh yeah so i'm going yeah so okay right i'll explain something here yeah right let me start from let me start from, from number number one and i'll explain and i'll explain the whole of verse one and two i think so it says let me start let me explain verse one it says in the beginning god created the heavens and the earth <clears throat> right heaven is where is where um is where jesus Jesus is his physical body now that part is just explaining where heaven and earth is they're, they're both separated but in in, in ultimately yeah, the reason why we're going into space is to bring the, bring heaven and earth together but we're doing that by building by building planets and, and worlds world worlds and worlds and many many different worlds uh without going into too much bible passages um, that's how it is. That's what that's what God has revealed to me um, in my in my training in my training um, in 2019 October 2019. We are we are literally Earth is Earth is level one. We are literally on level one, and we're literally going up like that. I saw I saw that on the map in my in spiritually in my mind, and that's what Jesus revealed to me. So we are li we are literally on ground one, ground zero. This is what I spoke about on on YouTube. So we're on ground one, ground zero one. That's what ground we're on, zero one, or ground one. Now, this is in the beginning. God created the heavens and the earth. Um, the, they were the two. They, those were the two planets that was, was created originally. Earth is down, as, is is here. Heaven is up here, and in the middle, we're jumping from planet to planet to planet to get to get to heaven, and we're gonna merge them together with many different planets, many different worlds. Now, um. The bit about um okay yeah so mu, mu, Mars is a planet okay so Mars is a planet the Moon is a planet the Sun is a planet um what else what else what else every everything that you see that circle is a planet so what it is is that um as we grow into 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 the, into the, into, the, into the universe, as we because of the, the, the universe is vast and big, and as we grow and grow, and as we maintain our lives, because the mind is a is a powerful tool, and we have to stay alive as best as possible by using our mind and using our strength, because the more you sink into yourself, the more you sink into yourself, the more you you you, you give up in life. Is the, that's how you kill yourself. You kill yourself by not doing nothing. The reason why we have to change is the re reason why we have to change is because it keeps us alive. That's why we always have, always have to do, do different things all the time. We can't go around doing the same thing all the time. We, we always have to do different things. <clears throat> Even if we're preaching, preaching the gospel, we're, we're preaching the gospel for, forever. We have to. We still have to do something different. Not just preach the gospel, but preach the gospel in a different way. This is why. Billy Graham is his son tried to preach the same message that he did in the past. This is this is not how we preach it. We can't preach like that anymore. We have to do it in a different way. The way how I do it is 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 through lifestyle evangelism. You gotta call it a different name. We gotta preach the gospel still. This is what I was doing before the before everybody else jumped on the bandwagon and started preaching on YouTube because I was there already before with before the the old before a lot of people so let me go on to um verse verse 2 and it says the earth was without form and void and darkness was on the on the face of the deep and the spirit of god was hovering over the face of the waters 
Now, when it says darkness, okay, when it says darkness on the surface of the deep, and the spirit of God was hovering over the face of the earth, waters. The reason why that is is is, is, is basically is basically describing how how it, how it is now, like how Mars is, how how the sun is, like how how all the sun is bright. It describes how how what it is it, what it is now because the way how God left it because eventually originally yeah okay you know God 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 is obviously okay originally before before God became a physical body he was originally was was a spirit and he still is a spirit and he is he is he is he was originally the stars he was God was originally the stars but even before that God did exist anyway because because I'm not trying to I'm not trying to dis 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 disintegrate or dismiss how God was created because um so that's how that's how that that's explained about the darkness was on the face of the deep and the spirit spirit of God hovering over the face of the of the waters when this is hovering over, over the face of the waters that's actually the stars hovering over the air I do believe that's the stars you know the stars itself. Because if you look at the stars, the stars in the night sky, the stars in the night sky are actually white, and and the holy the holy spirit is represented as water, and also the white is is a pure white is a purity. You notice when a man got gets old and he has grey hairs, his hair is actually white, and that that that, that symbolizes symbolizes a, a purity, because white is is very pure. Notice when when preachers get baptized, when preachers decide someone's gonna get baptized. They always use white, so it's it's a symbol of purity. So that's how that's how that's when God said it when He hovered over the over the waters. Now let me move on to the um. This is gonna take me years to, to sort this out. And I need to get cracking as well. God saw the light that it was good, and God divided the light from the darkness. God called the light day, and the darkness He called night. So the the he, so the e so the evening and the dark and the morning were the first day. Um, I don't know how he, I actually don't know how he separated the day from the night. But I mean, I mean, it's I you can actually say he did it by way of how how the how the moon was the sun was reacting. But that that's how, that's it's it's really how it is now. Really, it's just with people. And then we want to verse. Let me move on to V six. Uh, and then God said, "Let the let let the let there be the firmament in the midst of the waters, and let it divide the waters from the waters." Firmament. I can only think that's air and water, but I'm not I'm not 100 sure. So don't quote me on that one. But I can only think it's, it's to do with air and water, and that's to do it. That, that that was when he was trying to create planet Earth. It was physically creating planet Earth. He physically moved these things, physically put these things into position. Position he did that. He literally physically did that, and he did that away in a way of speaking it, in a way of actually really molding it and shaping it with his hand. He literally physically did that. Okay. Um. Then God said, "I'm on, I'm on nine now. V nine. Um." Then God said, "Let the waters under the heaven, heavens, be gathered together." So let me start again. Let, then God said, "Let the waters under the heaven, heavens, let the waters under the heavens gathered together into into one place, and let the dry land appear." And it was so. When He said that, He's when He talks about heaven, He literally was talking about planet Earth. This is all, and, and, and on top of that, that, that is, I do believe that's planet Earth he's talking about. Um, appear on it was so, and God called the dry land Earth. When he says Earth here, it means physical, physical. When he says Earth, it means physical soil, and it was mean it means planet Earth, as in the Earth, the soil the, where the ground that we walk on now. Um, when he said about heaven, he said about heaven. When he said about heaven, it wasn't just planet Earth. He also was talking about heaven above us in in the in the in the in the moon in the moon in the um in with the other planets like Mars, Neptune, um things like that, and the 
gathering together of the waters he called seas and God saw that it was good then God said let the earth bring forth grass the herb that yields seed and the fruit tree that yield fruit according to its kind whose seed is in itself on the earth and it was so and the earth brought forth grass the herb that yield seed to according to its kind and the tree and the, and the tree that yield fruit who set who seed in the itself according to its kind and god saw that it was good so the evening and the morning the first with the third day um v14 i'm carrying on these things just straightforward and then god said let there be light lights in the firmament wow what is that then god said let there be lights in the firmament of the heavens wow this one's gonna catch me up big time i need to look at something i'm wondering what is a firmament bear with me please Five press, okay. The heavens or sky that's exactly what he said firmament means um firmament literally just means and i'm not even looking at wikipedia because that's just no good um it says firmament f-i-r-m-a-m-e-n-t which is pronounced one minute Yeah, exactly how I pronounced it. Firmament. Um, it's pronounced firmament. It says, the heavens or sky. The heavens or sky. That's what it literally means. The heavens or sky. Which basically means just, it means, it, the heavens or sky, which basically just means um, the planets in, in, in the atmosphere, in the universe. Because all we have to understand is that heaven is literally, um, literally in the sky and that's where jesus is and it could and, and heaven is not like some distance away it's literally just nearby because once you get one once you leave the, the earth's atmosphere the earth's atmosphere you're literally in heaven if you're in space you're in heaven that's literally what he's trying to say and it's and and beyond that is like you can reach up to jesus eventually because it's a mystery how he's going to actually come back because i do believe when he does come back, it's a cry out. The world is going to be saved. And it's a cry out. When, he, when we cry out for the Lord, that's when he cries. That's when he'll come back. And when the world is holy, because eventually the world is going to be holy. This is what I saw in a vision in, in my training when I was when God was training me in 2019, October 2019. When the world is pure and holy and we all shout in Jesus' name, eventually, <clears throat> and when the universe cries out Jesus' name, that's when he comes back. We have to call on him. When we call on him, that's when he, that's when he, Jesus comes back. But until then, the world is not holy yet, but it will be holy. This is why we must stay alive. We must not, because the Bible says as well, 
What does it profit a man to gain the whole world and lose his one and only soul? The reason why that is, it's not because it's because of sin, it's not because of sin. It's the fact that you not you're not meant to die. That's what it's basically saying. You're not meant to die. Just think about this. Think about it. Really, really, really think about this. What does it profit a man to gain the whole world? I'm not saying about fame. I'm saying just one man to gain the whole world and lose his one and only soul. It profits him. A lot of people, preachers, say it profits him nothing. It is true. And the reason why it says that is because if you die, you lose your soul and you go to heaven or you go to hell. But the thing is, yeah. If you stay alive, you can build and build and stay alive just by the power of the mind. I don't know. I don't even know if you can actually. I don't even know if you can actually um find the cure of overcoming death. I think you only overcome death through the power of the mind. And because because we we just discovered, I just discovered today that a lady is able to give birth without being in pain. I can't recall what you call it now. It's it's. it's I can't record. They mentioned the name. It was on. It was on LBC. They're able to. Keep, it's not. It's not. For every woman, but they're able to give birth without any pain, and and that's what that's what princess. That's what um. That's what not 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 um. What's the other one? Not 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 Harry, but William William's wife. William's wife did that. But she was vomiting a lot. Apparently, I heard on LBC she was vomiting a lot, and um she 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 get she gave birth just through just through breathing exercises. That's what they're calling it, breathing exercises. And she was able to give birth. And some of these babies were massive. In because a lot of people were calling up and saying, Oh, these babies some of these babies weigh weigh eight ounces and like six ounces, I think it is. Um, but they were able to give birth without 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 any pain. So what that's what that's what's happened. So you really gotta understand the power of the mind, because the power of the mind is eternal life. Preachers preach things like, oh, when preacher when a preacher preaches, they preach things like um they say, Oh, eternity starts now, that's what they're saying. I've I've picked up a lot of information by just sapping it in. I know when I come to church, I don't say anything, but really I don't really I don't take notes because I don't I don't when I write things down I don't remember it that way and I don't and I don't like writing things down because for starters I can't even stand papers. It really winds me up. So when 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 I go into church, I go into church and I and I absorb everything that's said, everything that's said, and I go over it and I, and I think about it and I memorize it, and just by me reading the Bible every every day or once a week, I can pick up on what whether a preacher is speaking something the truth or not. If a preacher if, if a preacher says the same if a preacher says the same thing twice, then I'll take note of it. But if he don't say it twice, I won't say I won't take note of it. But anyway, let me read on here. Um, by the way, I'm going for the whole Bible, the whole entire Bible, because literally, yeah, yeah, I won't say it again. <clears throat> okay, um, so we did, we we've established what an affirm, what a firmament is, which is heaven, heavens and earth, which is here on planet Earth and in 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 in, in the universe, not not far away. So um, this is of the heavens get give light on the earth, and it was so, the six the sixteenth. Then God made two great lights, and the greater light to rule the day, and the lesser light, lesser light to rule rule the night. He made the stars also, set them in the firmament. That's incredible. So it seems to me that um. Ah, uh, wow. Then God made two great lights, the greater light to rule the day and the lesser light to rule the night. He made. I know. The, I know. It says here in the Bible, God created the light, the stars as well. But when I said earlier about God being a star, I do believe He was a different kind of star. Based on what God was revealed to me, but um, I still believe he was a star before he was before he came in human flesh or human body, because there are two types of two types of um. There's Jesus, and there's God Himself, but there's 
is a different kind. There's God is I've actually seen a very powerful image of God in my mind. And you and I'll explain that one day because it's very, very powerful because he's he's actually all, all white. He's so his hair is white, everything about him is white. The the whole when I say white here, we're talking like if you see how he turned on a screen, a, t a computer screen is white. He's just like that, but he's really high definition white. When I say God is white, he's high definition white. He's such a white that it's like he's incredibly white. His beard is white. His hair is white. His eyes, I'm not 100% sure what his eyes look like, but he's completely white because one time I looked in the mirror and I saw, my, I saw myself in the mirror. But then I had a glimpse, a, a, a very, a very vivid flash of what God looked like, and I have to say, he he has human body because in the Bible he talks in the Bible in Genesis, which I come to soon, he says God walked about in the cool of the day, which means that it was actually God, it was actually God Himself that walked about in the in the day. It wasn't Jesus yet, but it was actually God Himself. But I'll come to that in a minute. But it was actually God. So um. The lesser light to rule the night, the maiden, the, the so 17, V17. God set them in the firmament of the heavens to give light on earth, 18, and, the, and to rule over the day and over the night, and, the, and to divide the light from the darkness. And God saw that it was good, V19. So the heaven, the, the evening, and the morning. Were, were the fourth day v20 then god said let the waters abound what then god said let the waters abound with the abundance of living creatures and let birds fly above the earth across the face of the fulfillment of the heavens so god created great sea creatures and every living thing i have to move on quickly on this one um, move, moves moves the moves with the witch the waters abound abounded abounded according to their kind and every wing, winged bird according to its kind and god saw that it was good v22 and god blessed them saying be fruitful and multiply and fill the waters in the seas and let birds multiply on the earth v23 so the evening and the morning were the fifth day v24 then god said let the earth bring forth the living creature creature according to it its kind cattle and creeping thing and beast of the earth each according according to its kind and it was so v25 v and god made the be made a be made a what made a made a beast of the earth according to its kind cattle according to its kind and uh, and every every thing that cre creeps on the earth according to its kind and God said, so that it was good. V26. Then God said, let us make man in our image. Image according to the... In core, then, oh, fight. Then God said, let man, let, let us make man in our our image. According to our likeness. Let, he, let, let them have dominion over the fish of the sea. Over the birds of the of the air and over the cattle over the all the earth and over every creeping thing that creeps on the earth let me explain this here um you see how i said to you earlier how i saw god 100 percent white completely holding white and you see where it says there let's create man in our own image when it says in our own image that's what it talks about see you see god was actually is actually a kind of human but God is actually a, a powerful human being, but he's not—he's not actually human, but he, but he is. 
but he's so powerful that he's able to control things with just, just by the power of his thought and the power of his might. And the thing is, as well as that, he 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 he, he um he he's open. He's he's open himself in a way that he's able to control everything. And he, his mind is is a uh, is very vast, but uh oh, it's, it's just so it's it's very. What I'm trying to say is that it is actually God, and He is in the atmosphere and He's everywhere around us. But He is He has created Himself Himself as a God, but but he, but it is actually Him. But He's He's He's, he's in double He's in double double He's in double digits or He's in double He's in double form. So He's in He's in He's in He's in the image of a human being of a man, and He's also in the image of the of the of the air through. In the, he's in the image of the air, through in the air, in the air, in the air, in the atmosphere, and he's all around, all over. But on, but with, but on with that, he's, he's also with, he's all, he got also Jesus as well. So when he said, Let, "Let's make man our own image," in the image he created, he met in the. Let's, so when he says, let, "Let me read it actually." So when he says it, then God said, "Let us make man in our image." According to our likeness, it's basically just saying how we, how we, how in the image, in, in our image, how we, how, how we want him to look like, how we, we want him to look like, look like us, you know, like look us, look, look like God, look like um, look like us, but like and have and have our, our form and be like us and have different gifts. So that's what I'm saying. When God was originally there, He was He's He's actually a human because when I was walking around, in when I was unwell, God actually said the only people that's on the planet are on are on planet Earth now is 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 angels and demons on planet Earth. That's the only people that are on planet Earth at the moment. Angels and demons. That's the only people on planet Earth at the moment. So that's what God revealed to me. Well, not God, with Jesus, really, because Jesus is most speaking to me anyway. So, um, yeah, I just, so that, that's what I'm saying. Um, according to the likeness, let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, over the uh, birds of the air, and over the cattle, over all the earth, and over every creeping thing that creeps on the earth. V27. So God created man in His own image. In the image He of God, He created him, male and female. He created them. V28. Then God blessed them and said, said and said to them, Be fruitful and multiply, fill the earth and subdue it, have dominion over the over the fish of the sea, over the birds of the air, and over every living thing that moves on the earth v29 and god said see i have I've given you every herb that yields seed which is on the on the face of, of earth and every tree whose fruit yields seed to you it shall be for good v30 30 also for every beast of the earth so every bird of the air and to everything that creeps on the on the earth um earth earth um in which there is life i have given every green herb for for food and it was so v31 then god Saw every everything that he had made, and indeed it was very good. So the evening and the morning were the fifth day. V two, thus the heavens and the earth and all the host. Sorry, that's this is chapter two we're in now. Chapter two, thus the the heavens and the earth and all the host of were finished. V two. Um, and uh, on the seventh day, God ended His work, which He had made, and He rested on the sev seventh day from all His work, which He had made. 
the three, then God blessed the seventh day and the, the san, san, and sanctified it because it, it because in it he rested from all his work which God had created and made v four. This is the history of the heavens and the earth, earth when they were created in the in the day that the Lord God made the earth and the heavens. V five before any plant of the field was in the earth, and before any herb of the field had grown, for the Lord God had not caused it rain, caused it to rain on the earth, and there was no man to till the ground. V six but a mist went up from the earth and watered the whole face of the ground. V seven and the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground and, and breathed in, into into his nostrils the breath of life. The man became a living being. V eight the Lord God planted a garden eastward eastward in <coughs> Eden and there and there he put the man whom he had formed. Nine and out of the ground, the Lord God made every tree grow, grow that is ple pleasant to the to the to the sight and <clears throat> good for food. The tree of life was also in the midst of the garden, and the tree of knowledge of good and evil, which is actually the apple. It's, I'll explain that. I'll, I'll explain that in a minute good and evil v10 now a river went out of eden to, to water the garden and and from the, there it parted and became for four four riv, river heads v11 the name of the first is prishan persian Persian. persian the name of the first Persian. it it is the one which Skirts the the whole land of Havilah, 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 where there is God, where is it, where there is gold. V twelve, the gold, the gold of that land is good. Bedalum and the on onk stone are there. V thirteen, the name of the second river is Gahan. It it is the one which goes around the whole land of go of of Kush, V fourteen. The name of the of the third river is Hidekel. Hidekel, it is the it is a one which goes toward the east of Ashra. The fourth river is a Euphrates. V fifteen. Then the Lord God took the man and put him. When he said, when God said took the man, yeah, he didn't actually pick him up with his pick him up from the ground. He didn't just walk with him. It's not like he like he says, oh, he just sort of like pick him up and says, oh, you go there, you go there. It's a case of just you know, he just carried him and says, come with me, come with me. He was actually a human being, so he was like a, God was like a human being, but he was like he's very he's a very powerful human being. When I say powerful, I mean powerful. We're talking like, you know, he's so powerful here that you, you, Jesus has to be a representative of him because God can't help himself but to heal somebody. When someone has sin in their life, God doesn't want, doesn't want to kill them. God so, God so loved him or loved the person that he wants to touch and heal them. And, and because Jesus don't want them to be dead, God, Jesus goes before them and says, oh, steady on my father, steady on my father, steady on. Let me let me just try and talk with him, and you can heal him through me, my me, Jesus. So, when we get healing, it's actually God that heals us through Jesus. Because I know the mental illness I have, it has been healed before. When I was in training in twenty nine in October twenty nineteen, I was healed, and it's a lot more better than it was before. I don't hear the voice a lot anyway. And it's a lot less than it used to be. So it's 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 because of the training I had. Um, it's a very when I say training, it's a spiritual training between between me and Jesus. Jesus taught me a lot of things, and he actually um tested me by pricking my feet, my, my my thigh one time and says, 
He's, Jesus, Jesus actually said to me, do you feel that? And I said, yes, I do. So he actually talks to me and I hear his voice. And I, and I don't test it like I used to anymore. I literally, we actually communicate. I communicate with Jesus properly. Um, but let me carry on anyway. Um, then the Lord God took the man and put him in the garden and Eden, Eden to tend the, the tend and keep it. The Sixteen, and the Lord God commanded the man, saying, oh, "Of every tree of the garden you may freely eat." V seventeen, but of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil you shall not eat, for in the day that you you eat of it you shall surely die. Now let me hold it there. Yeah? You know that tree is actually an apple, and the reason why it's an apple is that I found out yeah that if you think about it, because I saw some some comments on 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 Facebook here about this guy. He said he looked at the he said it was a it was a it's actually a tropical apple, and it was one of those Jamaican pears, and I saw and I used to, I have had them before, but when I had a British pear, when I me personally when I had a British pear, it was very very nice. But it wasn't. He didn't. I mean, um, but the way how it's not really how I described it. But the um, wait for a minute. I'm trying to burp him. He's stuck. Um, when the guy, when the guy had, when the guy um said the way the guy the way how the guy described it is very powerful and it's just like he just like he described this. It's just like it's just like it's, it's just like it's how it's it's just like how it's described in the Bible. Now, wait, this is what he said. Yeah. He said, he said, listen carefully, listen carefully, listen very, very carefully to this. He said, yeah, he said he saw the apple, it really catched his eye. And when he ate of it, when he ate the apple, it blew his mind. That's what he said to, that's what he said in the, in the, on the Facebook Messenger. He said, I'll say it again, I'll say it two more, two more times. He said, when he saw the apple, it was, it was really, it looked, it looked really good. And he said, when he ate it, it blew his mind. I'll repeat it one more time. The, the guy said, "Well, I saw the apple, and when I ate the apple, it blew my mind." Now that that clicked to me, and I thought, "Yo, that's the apple." And it, and, and 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 if this is and if this is true, if if every country has an apple of of or a representative of an apple, then surely it has to be the apple. On top of that. If Apple is in America, if Apple is in Africa, because that's where that's where that's where the Garden of Eden was, because a lot there was a newspaper, there was a newspaper article talking about where 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 the Garden of Eden was, and, it, and I saw that um last year, and, it, and it's in it's in the articles now, and they've actually found the Garden of Eden. On top of that, scientists have created a new type of apple, a new type of apple, late 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 2019, they created it. It's a new type of apple, and it's chemically created. Chemically created. You see, you 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 catch what I'm saying. It has to be the apple. It cannot be anything else. A lot of people say they don't they don't they don't know what fruit it is, but it is the actual apple. And there's a, there's an apple called it's my favorite apple actually. There's an apple called the, the Pink Lady. It's very nice, very sweet. And there's a, there's there's a, there's about fifty thousand variations of apple in the UK. I think it's fifty thousand or over fifty thousand. Fifty thousand representative of different versions of apple. I don't know if we're the, we're the top, we're the number one, top most variation, but I know is over. I read it, I read it somewhere. There's, it was either twenty over twenty thousand or over fifty thousand represent representations of different variations of apples. It's it's very powerful. So this is what, the, when it says about evil and about you shall sure, sure, you shall surely die, that speaks of um worry because. I don't know what it is about the apple, but when you, I really don't know. It's it, it could, I, it's really bad <laughs> because it is so it's so bad because um it's so it's so bad it's really bad because um it's so bad um because and you you're probably wondering wondering why why was the apple created in the first place. If Adam and Eve waited, waited, and waited on God, God would eventually reveal it to them. And then, when, 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 when Adam, and, when Adam and Eve, if Adam and Eve didn't actually eat the fruit and waited on God, 
God would have probably then say, meet my son Jesus, or meet 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 somebody that's gonna sacrifice themselves for the apple so that you don't have to eat it, but they'll eat it before you so that you could, so you can actually eat it afterwards. They would have been able to eat it, but not yet, not him, because he's the first man and first woman, they cannot eat it. They weren't allowed to eat it yet until somebody ate it before them. When that person eats it before them, that's when they can eat it. Then it would because I think what God would have done is they would have let he would have let Jesus eat it and then God, Jesus would have anointed it for them to eat it, protect them, protect them from that, from that, that sin and guided them. And then that's when and that, and then that's when they, they could have been able to eat the apple. But because for whatever reason, you know how it says in the Bible about the serpent, which I'll explain that as well. But the thing is, yeah, ladies, ladies, no, ladies know something that a man don't know, and I do believe that that day when it happened, when it, when it, when, it, when when the woman ate from the, the forbidden fruit, he saw something in Adam that he was not capable of, of of managing this world, and capable of doing it. That's what I believe. I believe he, he did that because he wasn't capable of um, looking after this world. And that's because women are very, very clever. And I do believe that's the first argument, the first marriage argument in, 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 in that's the first marriage argument. That's the first era of marriage. This, the, that's the first era of marriage dispute ever in, on planet, on, on, on planet Earth. But I do believe that Eve saw something in Adam that he was, that he think that she thought he, that this, that, that she thought, oh, he's not capable. He's disqualified. He's not capable of actually taking care of me. You know, discord and all that kind of stuff. But it was, it was, it was through, it was through the deception of the serpent. That's why it happened. But I explain the serpent in a minute. I think you guys know about the serpent what it looks like anyway. But I know someone told me about what the serpent will, will look like. But I, 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 I might be to say something else about it. But I'll, I'll, I'll try and sort it out. Um. So it says, and the Lord God said, it is not good that man should be alone. I will make him a helper, com compar comparable to him. The reason why God says man should be alone is that when a man or a woman becomes alone, they will end up be becoming in their own thoughts. They come to, they come, be, they they they'll be emotionally disturbed, and eventually they'll they'll break inside themselves, and like destroy themselves, and they eventually they eventually will die. This is why you need to communicate with people. It doesn't matter where you are. You need to socialize with people. The socializing keeps you alive. If you don't socialize with people, you won't be alive. You will, you will struggle to, to still survive. And so that's how. That's why God says it's not good for a man to be alone because it will eventually kill us. And suicide is never an answer. Suicide is never the answer. So um, out of the ground, the Lord God formed every beast of the field and every bird of the air and brought them to Adam to see what he would call them. And whatever Adam called each each living create creature, that was its, its name, V20. V20. So Adam gave, gave names to all cattle to the birds you know you know something before I go to the next page if you if you want to confirm whether this is actually true if you hear Jesus voice speaking to you you need to you need to confirm this with Jesus because I can only speak through through what Jesus lets me speak from my mouth if I can't say it out of my mouth then like then it's not of God it's not of Jesus it's because God, Jesus literally controls my lips and my body and everything I do. And I am a seer, so I do do things for, for a reason. And and I don't lie, and I, don't, and I can't lie. It's impossible for me to lie. And and I do prophesy, and then all the prophecies, of, most prophecies have come true anyway. And some things I just forget about them, and it ends up coming true. So when you go, when you go in your own private time, test what I've said and actually ask God, is this true what Ricardo is actually saying? Is it 100% true? And if God tells you it's true, then it's true. And I can't take it back. 
because this is gonna go on YouTube as well. So I'm gonna try and try and spread it across so it goes. Yeah, but like I said, I'm here till 5 a.m. Um, I'll carry on now of the air and the, and every beast of the field. But for Adam, there was not found a helper com com comparable to him. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep <clears throat> to fall on Adam, and the sp and and he slept. And he this thing about this thing about slept. Science is very clever because they um find out a way of you know how they find a way of, of um putting man to sleep. That is literally an anesthetic an, an, an anesthetic, and this is where um God found. This is where people found anesthetics from chemically able to put people to sleep so it's very powerful what people have learned from the bible and built careers careers and jobs out of the bible so i just thought i'd put that in there anyway i'm sure it's for somebody so i'll start again from 21 v 21 and the lord god caused him a deep sleep to fall on adam and he slept and he took one of his ribs and closed up the, the flesh in its place V22 then the, the rib which the Lord God and had taken from him he made into woman and he brought her to him him brought her to the man and Adam said this is now bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh she shall be called woman because she was taken out of man by the way if you want to know how, what, what Adam and Eve looked like here yeah? Like I said, since they found him in Africa, they were actually black. And I got, a, there is something else about a black person rather than a white person. But the blacker the person is, the, which, is what, which is what God revealed to me, the Lord revealed to me, Jesus. The blacker the person is, the more nations they are, they, they are in them. The more, the, so the blacker they are, the, the more nations they have in them, the more, the more multiple different nations or people they have in, in, in them, you know, like Japanese, Chinese, Hong Kong. Um, Philippine. The reason why I got that is that um, I once saw a preacher one time on 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 the TV, and his eyes were very very squinty, and I thought to myself, wait, if his eyes are squinty, there are Japanese Chinese people that got squinty eyes. Could it actually be that a man or a woman, a black man, jet black man, a, 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 an incredibly dark man or woman, come from a black person, because? That, that you know we, we can't misunderstand what we see because what we see is actually real we can't just deviate from that we can't do that we, we must not do that we can't just say oh it's not true just because i see it doesn't mean it's true you know what you see is what you get and what you see is what you must believe you can you, i'm hoping you catch what i'm saying so that's what i'm trying to say um that's that's what gave me the idea. So you gotta really think about these things. We got we gotta really think about these things. So um therefore V twenty four, therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and he join and and be joined to his wife and they shall become one flesh. That passage there it says because a lady is a caretaker and and a, and the lady cares for a woman, cares for a man. Let me read it again. Therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and he join and be joined to his wife and they shall become one flesh the reason why the man leaves and also the woman leaves is because they need somebody to take care of them to actually motivate them and to spur them on to live a prosperous life to like live that's why that's why that's 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 why marriage has to be like that and marriage will always exist i mean even if i'm called to even if i'm called to be single Marriage will always be, will will always will always will always exist. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. So I do have the uh, the appetite to be with someone, but it's a case of just knowing what God wants. And I, and I can't I can't just take a woman that's actually called to be married. I can't do that. I'm not I, I'm not actually allowed to do that. I'm only going to take somebody. But there is a there is a sorry my my screen went went funny. But there is a, um I, there is a way that I will stick with that person for life, but. I can't discuss all of that here, so it's a bit private. Um, it's a, but you know, if you're called to be married, you need to be married. If you're not called to be married, you're not called to be married. But it's, you, we should always challenge ourselves and test God and say, you know, have you called me to be married, Father? You know, but you should. We should always spur on each other and try to get married. It's really, really important 
to get married to, to keep the marriage alive. We need to drink water. Um. Um. Therefore, man. Okay, I read that already. And they were both naked, the man and his wife, and they not, and they were not ashamed. It's because the sin didn't come in, in come into, come into, into being, and they weren't aware of um. They weren't. They weren't very clever. Basically, is what the Bible is trying to say, because um. They didn't do any shame. They relied on God. They trusted God. And that's why they knew no shame. Because they trusted God. And they, they believed that God was going to provide for them. They are the first carers. That they, or the first, first, they were, it, was, they were the, it was their first parents. They were, God was their parent. And by the way, Adam and Eve were fully bodied like me. Like fully bodied. Like proper arms, legs, that kind of thing. Man. I mean, I mean like... um. They weren't children, they, were, they weren't like little tiny tods. They were actually proper adults, proper men, proper women, proper man, proper woman. So he wasn't a kid. So, and they were both naked and man and his wife and were, and were not ashamed. Now the, the serpent, now the serpent was more cunning than any beast of the field which the Lord God had made. And he said to the woman, Has God indeed said, You shall not eat of every tree of the garden? Thee too. And the woman said to the serpent, We, sh we may eat the fruit of the trees of the garden, but of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden. God said, You shall not eat it. Nor shall you touch it, lest you, you die. Before then, the serpent said to the woman, "You shall, you will not surely die," which is actually true. You don't actually die, but but the the thing is because they didn't know. Let me stop there. At five. It is actually true. You don't actually die, but because because the serpent messed them around. To be honest with you, yeah. The reason why Adam and Eve die is down to the devil. Because God never Okay, God did say die, but it's a case of like it's a misunderstanding. And because of the misunderstanding, this whole world is at war and we're trying to live off what we're trying to <clears throat> fix what's been what's been made for Adam and Eve. It is it's so powerful sin that it's actually going so far that Jesus had to come through and said I come to die for you, die for your sins. It's like, you know, if 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 people did, if people understood, if people understood what it meant to um stay alive, then the world would have been way ahead many years ago. But but it's taken so it taken it's taken us two thousand twenty two thousand twenty years to realize that we're not actually meant to die. And this is all based on um, Adam and Eve's sin and the serpent deceiving the deceiving Eve. It's so sin is so powerful. And it's actually real, real sin, but it's just ah wow. It's it's a lot. It's it's. Well, I don't. I'm I'm a, bit, I'm a bit speechless to be honest with you. I'm a bit speech speechless. But um. Now the ser yeah I read already uh, and the woman said serpent we sh may we may eat the fruit of the trees of the garden but of the fruit of the tree which is in in the midst of the garden God said you shall not eat it nor shall you touch it lest you die then the, then the serpent said then the serpent said to the woman you will you will not surely die, for God knows that in the day you eat of it, your eyes will be opened, and you will you will be like God, knowing good and evil, <coughs> which is actually true. You know good and evil. You become like God, because we're all called. Let me stop there at number six. 
we are all called to be Adam and Eve's. We are all called to go to a planet and to take control of that planet and to actually own it and to actually preach from there. And, and that's when the Bible says oh, the kingdom will know no end. I'm jumping ahead of the game, but I'm going, I'm going to get there at the eventually. So, the, yeah. But let me read on because I don't want to drag on. So the woman saw that the saw the saw the tree and so so the woman saw well, the woman saw that the tree was good for food that it was pleasant to the eyes and a tree be desirable to to make one wise she took of its fruit and ate she also gave to her husband with her and he ate v7 then the, the eyes of both of them were opened and they knew that they were naked and they sewed fig leaves together and made themselves coverings v8 and they heard they they they, they heard, and they heard the, the sound of the lord God walking in the garden in the cool of the Adam and Eve what Adam Adam and Eve Adam Adam and, and his wife hid themselves from the presence of the Lord God God among the tree God among the trees of the garden then the Lord said God the Lord God called God Adam and uh, and said to him where are you um, I can't really say much about it. I don't. I just, I don't say about that. I'll move on. I'll move on. I'll move on. I'll move on. Um. So he said, "I heard your voice in the garden, and I was afraid because I I was naked and I had my and I hid myself." V eleven, and he said, "Who told you that you were naked?" Have you eaten from the tree of which I commanded you that you should not eat? Then, the, then, then the man said, said, said the woman, whom, who, 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 you, whom you gave to be with you, with, oh man. Then the man said to woman, said, then the man said, the woman whom you, whom you you gave to 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 be with me she gave me me of me of the tree and i ate and the lord said said to to said to the woman what is this you have done the woman said the ser the serpent deceived this oh let me start that a bit again and the lord said said to him what is this you gave you gave you, you have done the woman said the serpent deceived me and and i ate let me stop there you know something i made a mistake about the eternal life it's not just about your mind on top of that scientists have created a, a, a heart a heart like a, like a hybrid heart i heard this a few months ago they've created a hybrid heart so that you can actually you can actually like live for a long time in some ways, but just just the heart anyway. Um, yeah, so that's what that's what the Bible talks about in new bodies as well. That's another another section I gotta go into. Um, so Lord, and the Lord said to him, to to the woman, what is this you have done? The woman said, "The serpent, you, you just the serpent deceived me, and I ate." The Lord, the Lord God said to said to the serpent. So I think it's funny because the serpent could actually talk and communicate. It's a bit weird. That like, it's weird, and I'm getting tired as well. <laughs> um. Um, so the Lord God said to the serpent, "Because the, the, you have 
done this you are cursed more than all cattle and more 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 than every beast of the earth of the field on your on your belly you shall go and you shall eat dust all the days of your life so it was actually a snake that's what, that's what people were saying one person said to me um and he had an arm and he's very clever clever and deceiving and I, and I wouldn't be surprised if it's a, if it's a rat, rattlesnake it was i wouldn't be surprised because that would be eye-catching so um no more days On and shove bruise dust life put enemy and shall eat dust all the days of your life and I will put em enmity between you and the uh, and the woman and between your seed between your seed and her seed he she shall bruise your head he shall bruise your head and you shall bruise his Wow well, even I understand this thing about the heel and the foot um The woman he said I will greatly multiply your sorrow and your conception the pain you shall bring forth children your desire shall be for your husband and he shall rule over you I mean, well this always talks talk about marriage um v17 then then, 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 to, then to adam he said because you have ha, you you've headed the you because you have heeded the voice of of, of your wife and have and have eaten eaten from the, the tree of of which I commanded you saying you shall not eat of it curse is is the ground for your sake in all in, in, in toil and in toil you shall eat of it all the days of your life v18 both thorns and thistles it shall bring forth for you and you shall eat the, the herb of the field v19 in sweet in, in the sweat of your face you shall eat bread you shall eat bread till you till you return to the ground for out of it you were taken for dust you are and thus you shall return and at v20 v20 and adam then adam called the, his wife and adam called his wife wife's name eve because she was the, the mother of all living v21 also for adam and his wife the lord god made tunics of skin and cloth clothe and clothed them then the Lord God, V22, then the Lord God said, Behold, the man has become like one of us to know good and evil. And now let, let's, let's see put out his hand and take also of tree of life and, and, and eat and, and live forever. Therefore, the Lord God sent him out of the garden of Eden to till the ground from which he was taken v24 so he drove out the man and he and he placed cherubim, cherubim at the east of the garden of Eden and and a flaming sword which burned every 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 way to to guard the way to the tree the tree of life 
these um I'm on to I'm on I'm on chapter four and I'm getting tired. <laughs> I thought I might I might I'll come back a bit later to read it but um Yo yeah, I'm just trying to think I, I just hope I haven't I hope I just hope I haven't deceived anyone. But um yeah just ask Jesus please ask Jesus because um I'm just, just following the Lord. Skin move when I was when I was going through the Bible as well. So it must be from God anyway that like, where God wants to because because the law wants to do wants to do this, it seems at the moment. But anyway, um, I'm very tired now. <laughs> wow. But then again, the heat just makes my makes it get cold easily. Guys, gals, um, oh dear. I'll come back later. I'm a bit, but I'm. A, I'll continue where I left off. Um, like, like, um, like, um, next time. Oh. So, guys, gals, I um, or, or mainly guys. Yeah. I'll talk to you all soon. I'll come back again. I'll come back again a bit later. I'm just taking a break, or maybe tomorrow. I'll see how it goes. Take care. God bless. Peace. Shabbat. Ricardo Cook speaking. Bye. You'll see ya.